KSL News at 6 starts now. Good evening. We are just learning the water is back on in several bountiful neighborhoods tonight. Families thankful to open their taps again after more than 24 hours without. New specialist Shelby Lofton spoke to impacted residents and the department about what's going on. Shelby, the city says this what's happening is unusual. Mike and Dini, that's right. The water department director told me they typically don't see this many leaks at one time. And fortunately, those leaks are fixed now. This one in this neighborhood took more than 24 hours for them to get sorted out. But the director told me that it is possible there could be more leaks this winter. I woke up and getting ready to brush my teeth. A ton of brown water coming out of the faucet. Mainline breaks across Bountiful caused a rough start for some. Looked in the toilet, a bunch of brown water there. Turn the faucet to the tub on and let it fill up. Tons of brown water, a lot of sediment like buildup coming out too. The city's water department director said it is leak season. Some of them are just the degradation of the pipe, and then some of them can deal with pressure issues. Three mainline breaks at once is not normal. It's pretty irregular to have this many at one time. They're generally spread out over the course of multiple days when this, things like this happen. One of the leaks started around 7 a.m. Monday. It left crews chasing pipe problems for a day and a half. That is unusual for the crews to be out that long. Director Craig Christensen said they put in about 40 feet of new pipe. It is possible the water inside homes will be discolored. When we charge up, it picks up the little bits of minerals and deposits that are on the inside of the pipe. Wes Dickinson says he's seen it before. It happened to us about three or four months ago. Same thing. We were about to start laundry, and I think our neighbor came and warned us uh, before we started our laundry uh, that her load, entire load of laundry just got ruined. Um, real rust, kind of kind of red-looking rust substance. He hopes the work done today is a permanent solution. The city came, a bunch of trucks and some heavy equipment, dug this giant hole and uh, took the old stuff out and hopefully put something better in its place. Christensen said if more leaks come up, they have supplies ready to go. It can happen. And the water department says if the water does end up staining your clothes or any of your appliances, they do have stain removal you can pick up for free down at the Bountiful City Water Department. They encourage anyone with any kind of questions to go ahead and give them a call. I'll send it back to you. All right, Shelby, hopefully they've got all the leaks for now.